Virginia Governor Glenn Youngkin and First Lady Suzanne Youngkin were in Nelson County this morning visiting some four legged residents in need of dire help. As 10 News reporter Tim Harfman shows us, it was part of a special ceremony honoring a group for their dedication to animals. Virginia Governor Glenn Youngkin and First Lady Suzanne Youngkin spent Thursday morning with Red, Beethoven and Patches, three horses recently seized by animal control and taken to Hope's Legacy Equine Rescue in Afton. Executive Director Maya Prue says the animals were in bad condition and need treatment. We should be able to get them rehabilitated and they are three of the sweetest horses we've ever met, so hopefully we'll be able to find them good homes eventually. They're not the only equines Prue and her 80 volunteers are caring for on this 170 acre farm. This year we've taken in 54 so far. Um, we've got three more coming in tomorrow and I've got about 24 horses on our waiting list. Since 2008, the nonprofits cared for 500 animals, either seized by authorities or surrendered by owners who could no longer care for them. For their service, the organization received the Spirit of Virginia Award. It's about the it just extensive good that exists at a time where almost everybody wants to focus on the not good. It sounds uh, kind of cliche, but we were blown away to be nominated to begin with, and then uh, to actually receive the award was just phenomenal. The Yunkins are presenting six of these awards each year. This was the third one given out in 2022. So many Virginians are doing extraordinary things to help Virginia be the best place to live, work, raise a family, and own a horse. And be a horse. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> in Nelson County, Tim Harfman, 10 News, working for you.